come, let us make a one resolution. It is time to kill this corruption. Now is the time for a peaceful revolution. Revolution, revolution. revolution. Yeah. Yeah. Kenya mama yangu Kenya. Kenya mama yangu Kenya. Kenya mama yangu Kenya. Kenya mama yangu Kenya. Kenya inchi yangu Kenya. Kenya inchi yangu Kenya. Kenya inchi yangu Kenya. Kenya inchi yangu Kenya. I am here and we are all here because we are increasingly concerned at uh, the situation in Kenya. What we are seeing is a political class and we must make no mistake about this. Nothing divides the parties, nothing divides the individuals. They are united by their common interest in manipulating the people of Kenya in order to gain political power and through that to, to accumulate massive wealth. Tumejitokeza hapa leo, tumejikusanya vikundi mingi. Hatuja toa list yote lakini tutaendelea kuitoa na tuko na wafanyi biashara watu uh, uh, civil society uh, wananchi wa kibinafsi uh, na tunaunda hii group ya kushikilia katiba yetu we cannot go to sleep when there is a bumper harvest in one part of the country and the people not only starving but their wealth is disappearing before their eyes Thank the you. state has violated its constitutional obligations and it's not aware that it has done so we have to make the state aware and act very rapidly. We pledge to work together to defend the constitution, to fight corruption, to promote reconciliation among our diversity of peoples. We similarly pledge to directly resist those who steal from us those who actively work to ruin the future of our youth. Those who are named um, by the prosecutor of the SEC and who happen to be public officials should resign to uh, uh, clear the way for an independent process involving the SEC. We call on the government to take seriously its constitutional obligations to respect, protect and fulfill the rights of the people including the freedom of expression, the right to education, to housing, and the right to food. It is time to kill this corruption. Now is the time for a peaceful revolution. We are willing to work together with all those who are genuinely committed to reform, including those in government and parliament. But we also recognize that there are many vested interests in government, parliament, and business who are opposed to reform. Their network is extensive and their capacity to sabotage the constitution is formidable. Uh, at this stage we have no uh, plans for, for a political movement, but it is quite like, likely, possible anyway, that uh, some members of, of our grand coalition, as I've called it, will wish to, um, uh, to enter into, uh, uh, into politics in the sense of maybe competing for public office. Uh, this campaign will be followed up by a series of specific actions across Kenya, beginning with meetings, rallies, county gatherings all over the country, and culminating in a people's convention later this year. Uh, and, and one of our objectives would be to uh, 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 develop relations with these commissions which have been set up, with uh, ministries which have specific responsibilities. We are not seeking confrontation. We want to work with them, uh, to assist them, but also to watch them, to monitor them. It is a long struggle. We have a very entrenched government, entrenched political class, and it is not going to be easy to bring about the change. But the change will only come if people take the responsibility for change. This is our country, this is our constitution. It will not be implemented, or if implemented, it will not be implemented in the, in the correct spirit, in the spirit of justice, in the spirit of transparency, in the spirit of integrity and accountability, if we leave it to the political class. They are not interested in implementing the constitution. It is our responsibility. Uh, we will all struggle together. We want to work with all the groups that wish to work with us. There's no hierarchy in our 
organization, everyone who wishes to participate in the ways that uh, uh, relate to their own background and skills and experience, we would greatly welcome those contributions.